If the destructive capabilities of natural hazards are well known, the chain of events happening in their wake is every bit as destructive. Without development efforts, these ripples can have long-term effects on employment, health, population migrations, and perpetuate the cycle of poverty. The People's Republic of China's vast territory is exposed to a diverse range of natural hazards. From severe droughts to devastating flooding, tropical cyclones, earthquakes and landslides, the country faces numerous challenges. And these threats are not going away. On the contrary. Climate change and rapid urbanization are increasing the frequency and intensity of disasters. In our modern society, the web of interconnected urban functions is becoming highly vulnerable to hazards as they ripple through the whole system quickly and cause secondary and derivative damages. Rural areas, mostly populated by the elderly and the youth, due to the massive migration of workers to cities and industrial zones, have seen their coping capacity weakened, while land contract systems result in disaster-induced debt by leveraging exposure to natural hazards. Carefully designed disaster risk management is critical to limiting vulnerabilities and strengthening sustainable recovery capabilities. However, there is no one-size-fits-all solution. By engaging key stakeholders, decision-makers can tailor solutions to their specific geographic, social and economic contexts. This is crucial for addressing both the complexity of urban systems and the unique challenges faced by the rural areas of the People's Republic of China. Cost-effectiveness principles are vital as well, as they ensure the most impactful and effective measures are prioritized and that they benefit all, in the country and the region. Because natural hazards know no borders, collaboration with neighboring countries is essential in the promotion of regional disaster resilience. As natural hazards show no signs of abating and continue to pose significant threats, the time to adapt and prepare is now.